zero. Research explorer in time and space. Somewhere in a remote, uncharted region of the planet called Earth stands the laboratory of Captain Zero. In this secret location, known only to a few in the outside world, Captain Zero and his associates experiment in time and space to learn from the past, to plan for the future. Contact and established. We now transmit you direct to the laboratory of Captain Zero. Please stand by. Zero to Jet. Come in, Jet. Over. Jet to Zero. Come in, Captain. Over. All secure, Jet. I'll contact you when I'm ready to land. Zero. Over and out. Yes, sir. Jet, out. off from Mars or Venus right now. I'd be famous. I'd go down in history as the first man to fly to another planet. First man to fly. Zero to jet. Come in, jet. Over. Zero to jet. Come in, jet. Over. Jet! Yes, sir? Come in, jet. Over. Oh, yes, sir. Jet to zero. Come in, Captain. Over. It's about time. What in the world were you doing? Over. Well, I... I... I know. Sound asleep, huh? Well, uh, no, not exactly. I... I was sitting here concentrating. Okay, never mind. Alert the North Field. I'm coming in. Zero. Over and out. Yes, sir. At once, sir. Jet, out. Tetro. Yes, Jet? Captain Zero's coming in on the North Field. Right. She comes. Man, what a ship. Golly, wish I'd been born a couple of hundred years ago. I bet I'd have thought of making airplanes even then. I'd have been famous. I would have gone down in history as the first man in the world ever to fly. Oh, hi, Captain. Hi, Jeff. How'd it go? Did you have any trouble? Not a bit. The ship operated perfectly. But what happened to you? Well, uh, I guess I got kind of lost in thought. You mean daydreaming? Uh, yeah. I was the first man in the world ever to fly. You know, Jet, you'll fly a lot higher if you learn to keep your feet on the ground. What do you think of her? Boy, she sure is a beaut. How fast will she go? I don't know exactly. She's still in the experimental stage. I had her up to about 12 miles per second, but she's built to go twice that fast. 